Obituaries are sponsored by Colonial Funeral Home and Stokes Chapel, Fair, Ray, and Perry Spencer Funeral Homes, Boone and Cook Funeral Home and Crematory. Two announcements from Colonial Funeral Home. The family of Ola Smith Linville will receive friends today, beginning at 10 at Oak Grove Baptist Church, followed by funeral services at 11, with interment at Oaklawn Memorial Gardens. The family of Jimmy Ray Tilly will receive friends this evening, 6 to 8. Four announcements from Perry Spencer Funeral Homes. Public viewing for Ellen Adeline Galloway Carter is tomorrow, 12 to 1.30 in Eden, with funeral services at 2. Public viewing for Leonard J. Threadgill will be held Thursday, 1 to 7.30 in Madison. The family will receive friends at the home of Mary Threadgill Thursday, 3 to 8. Private burial services at Salisbury National Cemetery. Arrangements for Laney A. Flippin, 46 of Greensboro, are incomplete in Madison. Arrangements for Harold G. Harris, 75 of Eden, are incomplete in Eden. Two announcements from Fair Funeral Home. Arrangements for Margie Wilson Stickle, 98 of Martinsville, are incomplete. Betty Ann Jones Sawyers, 91, of Eden, died Sunday. Funeral services will be held Thursday at 11, conducted by her nephew, Chaplain Dusty Ball, and Pastor Rob Keaton and Minister Roy Molden at Kings Highway Christian Church, where she was a longtime member. The family will receive friends one hour prior to the service. Burial at Woodlawn Cemetery. She was a retiree of Fieldcrest Mills and preceded in death by her husband of 60 years, William Billy G. Sawyers. Surviving are Sister Patricia Ball. The family thanks the staff of Hospice of Rockingham County. In lieu of flowers, memorial contributions may be made to Hospice or to St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. A service of remembrance for Jack Jake Bray, Sr., is being held Saturday at 2 at Central Christian Church. The family will receive friends at 1 and other times at the residence. Boone and Cook Funeral Home and Crematory is serving the family. <laughs> 